The City of Vernon's Water Reclamation Centre, completed in 2004, is an advanced wastewater treatment facility including nutrient removal and ultraviolet light disinfection. This building contains the initial preliminary treatment and airborne odor control treatment systems. This is where the initial preliminary treatment occurs. Coarse solids are removed by a 6mm traveling screen, while inorganic solids settle in grit chambers. The solids are then deposited into bins, which are sent to the city landfill. While there are two channels containing traveling screens and two grit chambers, only one channel is in use at this time. After the wastewater has been screened, the grit settled and both removed, the wastewater is then pumped to the primary clarifiers. These are the dissolved air flotation tanks. They use compressed air to make tiny bubbles which float the biomass solids to the top of the tanks. When the biosolids are concentrated on the top, they can be skimmed and then sent to the centrifuges for additional dewatering. Once the biosolids have been dewatered, they are sent off site to be used as a soil additive at the composting facility. Here you can see the centrifuges removing water from the biosolids before being sent off-site. Airborne odors are contained in this building and treated within these two activated carbon filters before the stripped air is discharged from the stack above the building. Here you can see the fermenter. The fermenter digests the primary solids that are removed by the primary clarifier. Anaerobic bacteria live in the fermenter. These bacteria break down the organics and stabilize the sludge before it is sent to the centrifuges to be dewatered. These are the primary clarifiers and bioreactor area. The three primary clarifiers are covered for odor control. The three bioreactors are aerated to provide oxygen to the biomass which treat and clean the wastewater. The health of the biomass is critical to wastewater treatment, so continual monitoring is essential. These large blowers provide air to the biomass living in the bioreactors. Here you can see the three secondary clarifiers. The biomass that have treated the wastewater are settled and concentrated in these clarifiers and then recycled back to the bioreactors or sent to the dissolved air flotation tanks. After the biomass have consumed all the organics in the wastewater, the water is now treated. When the treated water passes through these sand filters, any of the last remaining particle solids are caught up and further cleaned. In these two channels, ultraviolet light disinfects the reclaimed water to kill any remaining bacteria before the water is pumped to the McKay Reservoir. 100% of the treated water from the Reclamation Centre is reclaimed as irrigation water. These large lift pumps move the reclaimed treated water 7 kilometers to McKay Reservoir. The 190-acre McKay Reservoir stores the reclaimed water for irrigation use around the Commonage, Predator Aid Golf Course, Vernon Golf and Country Club, and other locations.